Hi there! Welcome to ACDC Photo Studio 2018. My name is Adam. In this video, I'm going to combine the polygonal selection tool with layers and masks to give my subject a pop-out effect. For those of you familiar with ACDC products, ACDC Photo Studio Ultimate 2018 continues the ACDC Ultimate legacy. I'm going to open up an image in edit mode. Navigating to our top toolbar, I'm going to choose the Polygonal Selection tool. The image I've chosen here is an image with a tablet. The tablet has a large amount of white space. This is where we're going to place our subject. With the tool active, I'm going to select the edge of the display. We can simply double click to finalize the selection. Once I've made my selection, I'm then going to save the selection by navigating to select from the menu bar and then clicking save selection. This enables me to bring up the selection at any point. Navigating now to our film strip, I'm going to choose an image and drag it onto our layer panel. Alternatively, I can use the add a file as a layer button from beneath the adjustment layers and then just simply browse to the image I want. After adding the image to our layer panel, we'll be prompted to move the image. The yellow bounding box that appears on the edge of our image can help with this. I'm going to click and drag to move the image up. I can also rotate this image, expand or contract it by clicking on the corners. Once we're happy with the location of our image, we click commit from the top left corner of our image panel. I'm then going to load my selection by navigating to select once again and choosing load selection from the drop down menu. With my old selection active and layer two highlighted, I'm going to click add layer mask from underneath the adjustment layers. This will mask out everything other than what is contained within our selection. To remove the selection box, navigate once again to select and choose deselect from the dropdown. Now we're going to duplicate our layer 2 by clicking the duplicate layer button from underneath the adjustment layers. I'm going to remove the layer mask by clicking the button right here and we're going to make a new selection. This time I'm going to use the brush selection tool from the top menu bar and set the smart brush method to magic. I'm then going to select the top portion of the flamingo. This is the portion that will pop out of the screen edge. Magic selections allow us to target specific pixels by similarity of colors and tones. In this case, they're pink. If I lower the tolerance, the process would act more exclusively. I suggest playing around with these settings to find a workflow that suits you. After the selection has been made, we're going to once again click the Add Layer Mask button. Slight cleanups may be needed here and there. Lastly, I'm going to add a slight photo effect to give the image a more universal lighting. Here I'm using the Instant Photo Effect. ACDC would like to thank Kia Toon for making their art available freely please visit their personal profile, which are in the description below. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for tutorial videos and guides of ACDC. Click the link to learn more and please like, comment, or subscribe.